My name is Kai and I am the founder of Iron Rooted. I got into leatherwork in college. I started designing bags and other utility goods after I was struggling to find things for myself um, that were both elegantly designed but also minimal and uh, durable and long lasting. Just didn't seem like people did all of those things in one place. So I just started this company after I graduated. Right now I'm doing a custom project making leather uh, wrapped railings for a local brewery. My process starts with design. I'm, I'm very, very careful and purposeful with every cut, fold, and stitch that I put into any project. Um, and from there it's really just drawing, prototyping, using the prototype, trying to flesh out mistakes, consistencies, and then it's that process over and over again until I'm happy with the results. This project has been kind of challenging because we've had to work around COVID-19 and all of the new social practices that that's brought with it. So whether it's on-site or off-site, I've had to do the entire project uh, while practicing all of these new social norms, whether it's social distancing or face masks, things I've learned, how to work on site, communicating with a client, being efficient in the ways in which you speak to them, learning all the skills and techniques required to do kind of quirky jobs like this, whether it's like wrapping handrails like I'm doing now or making bags for people based on their ideas. Uh, this particular job took about three days, um, but every project is different. So some projects can take hours and some can take weeks or months. I used to hand sew all of my bags and doing custom bags that are completely hand sewn can take up to a month and a half to make. I believe in the idea that we should take pride and comfort in things that we know will last to carry our story. Um, every scratch and stain and mark, it's unique to each person and each piece. And after a while, you'll have something uh, that nobody else has or can recreate. Something that is kind of an extension of you, instead of something that was just going to go into the garbage.